Now it's time for world soccer stories. Liverpool looked like the dominant Jurgen Klopp side of old as a 3-0 win over Aston Villa at Anfield on Sunday maintained the Reds' unbeaten start to the new season. Dominic Soboslai with his first goal for the club and Mohamed Saleh were on target either side of Matty Cash's own goal. Victory takes the Reds to within two points of Manchester City at the top of the Premier League. But it was the manner of victory and a return of 10 points from a tricky opening four games of the new season that will have Liverpool fans dreaming of a title challenge once more. Either side of Liverpool's first title in 30 years in 2020, Klopp's men missed out on the title to City twice by a solitary point in 2019 and 2022. However, last season they slumped to fifth in the Premier League to miss out on Champions League football for the first time in seven years. A return to the top four looked like it could be the limit of Liverpool's ambitions for the new campaign after a difficult summer in the transfer market led them to miss out on a number of targets. Klopp has had to completely rebuild his midfield, but new signings Serbos Lai and Alexis McAllister have slotted in with ease. Arguably, the Reds' most important business of the window was turning down a huge offer from Saudi side Al Ittihad for Mohamed Salah this week. Salah was a constant threat and there is little doubting Liverpool's firepower up front, with Darwin Nunes now finding his feet after a difficult first season. Nunes was rewarded for his match-winning contribution off the bench with two goals away to Newcastle last weekend with his first start of the season.